Alrighty, hi, I'm Mike Fiente, and yesterday I made a video that got one view, and I'm hoping to get more than one view today. What is, what was that video? It was me trying to beat the known world record on WarioWare DIY's Mona Stage. <laughs> it's just something that I've had in my mind for a while that I want to do, so I'm doing it. No questions asked, because there's no guarantee that any given thing on YouTube will get views. You can try to game the algorithm, and I've tried sometimes, and sometimes it's worked out pretty well. Other times, I've tried and it hasn't worked well. Sometimes, I've not tried and it happens to work out well. Sometimes, I haven't tried and it doesn't work out well. And that's fine. What matters is that I'm enjoying myself <laughs> by playing silly little games made for kids. <laughs> Whatever. Just a way to relax in the evenings. Not just a way. A way to engage myself in the pursuit of something chasing a goal, even if that goal is ultimately meaningless. That goal being to get 297 po Oh no, this is like a really hard minigame when your touchscreen is like five times bigger than a real screen. Realistically, so my screen is the size of the entire computer window right now. Well, the emulator screen in total, counting the top screen, whatever. Point is, this is obviously a much larger window than the actual Nintendo DS is. That can be good and that can be bad. It means that I don't have to be as precise as I usually would, but it also means that my mouse has to travel a larger distance than normal. Obviously, me using, me using a mouse instead of a DS stylus generally... Oh, no. oh my god, I'm so bad at this. ...is a problem. And it's good and bad at the same time, depending on what kind of minigame I'm playing. Using the emulator is not inherently better or worse for this game, or any given video game, than using the DS. Obviously there are some games where being on an emulator has an advantage and disadvantage. Not really sure which of those is the case in WarioWare, especially in this one. I'm gonna guess it's more of a disadvantage? I don't know, actually. I would say during the earlier stages it's more of an advantage, but during later stages it's more of a disadvantage, because you have to be precise and fast. Being precise is easier, being fast is harder. And of course, <clears throat> in the earlier, in the early game where you don't have to be as fast, that's supposed to be easy anyway. So yeah, I guess playing this on a real console would be easier. The world record, or what I think is the world record, was played on an actual DS, but I don't want to like, I'd rather have more pristine footage of my game, I don't want to like record my DS and I don't want to deal with getting a capture card or whatever, not, not dealing with that, games are too expensive anyway. So emulator it is. Nominally, I am one-tenth of the way there. Jesus, I almost lost. Way to go. Oh, well, I'll be one-tenth of the way there once I hit 30. Don't want to count my chickens. This stage here, Mona's stage, has boss battles every 11 minigames, which, are, which makes it easier. Because boss battles are your only chance to regain lives. Otherwise, you're stuck with four fails. Arrgh! Effectively, you're allowed to fail once every 11 games at no penalty. Assuming you ace the boss minigame every time. This also has a pretty easy boss minigame. So, as long as I just fail once every 11 times, I should be good. If I happen to fail multiple times in a stretch of 11, I can just have a perfect run and make up for it. Yeah, this minigame is pretty simple. Wait until the balloons cross over the middle of the screen and then then click or tap. <laughs> Alright, halfway there. Or a tenth of the way there. Jesus. I wish. Alright, I don't I don't have much else to say. Oh gosh. Uh, uh, let's go! No. No! Yes! Oh thank god. I forgot that you got multiple shots there. 
Nice. Ugh, I keep failing at that one. I need to get better at not failing that. Oof. I almost felt like I was going to miss that one. Mm -mm, Jesus. Oh my gosh. I, f I feel myself slipping already. Okay, good. Consistently, I, I missed one and then got it back. Keep getting the gold bars. I don't know what the RNG is on getting the valuable items. Oh no, this is the hard mini game. Oof. Nice! Hit it a little early that time. That one's easy, just tap three times. Oof! You gotta have good timing for that one. No! I clicked him! Mm. That's so bad. I'll, I'll be okay, I'll be fine. Just, I'll get up to three here, and then if I have a perfect run for the next 11, I'll be back up at four. I'm a sixth of the way there. Or, or a fifth. I I haven't been doing the math. Oh god. Yes! That's huge. That, easy, easy game. That's an easy game. No! Oh my god! Wow, I... That should not have... I should not have gotten the win on that one. You see those things like, get. Mmm. That minigame is like instant death at this point. <sighs> I almost failed that one too. Okay. I'll get back up to three here and I'll be fine. Kind of. The timer is also really forgiving, fortunately. Oh, man. I'm confidently 20% of the way there. But it only gets harder. Uh, no! I, oh my god! Gonna have to use the smaller computer screen. Instant death mini game. God damn it. Four wrinkles. Sometimes it's three, sometimes it's four. Yes. Okay, good. No, mm, mm, uh, that's not good. That's very bad, actually. Man. Well. Did better than last time, that's for sure. Better than I've done in, since I... Don't, since I, uh... You know, yeah. <laughs>